Hey, what's up guys? It's Gino, and today I'm going to show you how to access any website you want in school or in any other location that has like um blocked websites. Um I use this at my my mom's job and I also use this at school a lot. Um what this does is basically it's like a proxy program thingy. Um I don't really know what it's called, but it's a really cool website that allows you to go on any website that you want like a proxy website would do um, but it's a proxy program all you do is download it and open it up and run it and bam you can go on any website you want but this is the website right here um, this link will be in the description below so you can go ahead and check it out um, once you get to this website just go ahead and press this little yellow box over here for a free download now um, this little thing down here should pop up saying you zip you dot zip so it's a zip file a raw winwar so once you see your desktop, you just right click it and extract the files here to your desktop or to wherever you want to extract them to. Now, I use this a lot. Um, it's a really cool program. It's, it's portable as well. You can like, put it on your USB. If you can't bring your, your, your laptop to different places, then you can just bring it on your USB or whatever. And like drag and drop it on your USB and you always will have it wherever you go but that's the reason why I like this program a lot because I have this on my USB and wherever I go my USB is on my keychain so I'm always gonna have this program with me now I always use this program because I don't feel like going to websites like google.com because Google is not blocked where I live I don't know if anybody else Google is blocked but that's pretty stupid if it is but I just go to Google and type in a proxy sites proxy site list that's what I used to do all the time for school like right there there's a whole bunch of them 2011 they, they, like, they update them a lot and you just go to one right here and like they give you all these websites right here but that's a waste of time by the time you're done with this your class is like halfway done already and like wasted like 10 minutes of your class period of playing games or like going on Facebook or going on YouTube or doing whatever you want to do so this is why this program is really good now once it gets on your desktop and you extract it you'll have this little program right here um, you could just mess around with it, put it wherever you want to hide it from the teacher. But once you get that, right click it and just open it, or you could run at run as admin. Um, but yeah, so this website should pop up right here. It's just the uh, the home page. You could just close it out, and once you just opens up, you could just go right here to options, and like this little go lock down here is gonna be shining right here. But like there's a whole bunch of little things here that you could do like once you close out your web browser it automatically deletes the history the cookies and all that stuff so it's also good on this like if you want to use it at home so if you don't want your parents to see what you did just use this program and like they like it'll clean out the whole computer basically every time you close the web browser so this is why it's a really good thing you can hide the golden lock after take off takes um like it takes out the gold lock down here as you see right here take effect on the Next start, like as the, as next time you start off this program, like the go lock is not going to be there. I'm not, and then you can just press OK. And if you don't want this showing, you can just lower it down here. And bam, like not even down here. Like you can't even see it. When you start thing, you have to reopen it or whatever. Or go down here and press this. And like that. But like you just do give a feedback. I did already, and I told him that this program is really good. You can go to the help menu if you need help. If you want to retry, like the search thing, and yeah, you close it out, like right here, exit warning will pop up, and it says like, like you could close an exit or like close it and keep it running. So that's like also a cool thing to do. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna close and exit the program, and as you see, the go lock went away, and now let me just see if I open it back up. Yeah, as you see, the go block is not there, but this thing popped up. You could just close that out and. If you go back to options, the the gold block is the gold lock is hidden. All right, so that's a pretty cool program. Um, I guess wanted to show you guys it. And this also, before I go, um, this website is also pretty cool because, like, if you get banned from like hack forums or something, like, I don't know if anybody's familiar with that, or if you get banned from a certain website, like game battles or something, like, you could go on, open up that program. Oh, I forgot it's like .net, but you could like open up that program and like go to this website right here and like register with a different proxy or whatever any, any single time you want or you can also go to gamebattles.com 
and like make it as much as you count accounts that you want because they do check your IP on half of the sites out there now. So like yeah, this will this program will basically help you for all that. But yeah, you can go down here and then there's there's like a USB tutorial video. Don't know why they made that. It's like common sense. You open up your you plug your USB into your computer and a little thing will pop up, just drag and drop it into your folder on your USB. And then whenever you go to the school sign, just plug it in the computer and open up your USB and run this program. There's no installation or nothing like that. So I hope this tutorial helped guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe if all this helped. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace out guys.